overheard mom and dad saying something that there is garbage somewhere in the ocean that is twice the size of Texas yeah. that can be cleaned up. Like mm -hmm. twice this isn't that like the biggest state? I'm supposed so, to like, say it's twice the size of Texas, y'all. If you're talking about Texas, you gotta uh, be southern. Okay. And it's twice the size of Texas, y'all. There you go. No, Javen, where'd you come from? I know why they say it's twice the size of Texas because when you look on t and Texas on a map, it's pretty tiny. What? <laughs> oh, Texas is huge, bro. <laughs> You're fired. No, on a map. Like, You're fired. Tiny. I can cover Texas with my hand. Yeah. Well, yeah. Javen, if I donate $100, how many pounds of trash would they take out of the ocean? 100 pounds. Bella, if I donate $100,000, can you guess how many pounds of trash they'd take out of the ocean? 100,000 pounds of trash. Honey, yes. if I donated $100 million, how much trash would they take out of the ocean? None, because I'm going shopping. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so they are trying about. to raise how much money to take 30 million pounds of trash out? Anybody? 30, 30 million, million dollars. dollars! Team C's! 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 All right, let's go! Hello dear friends, welcome back to the Majestic Family Channel. My name is Jory, my lovely wife Biname is holding the camera. Hey guys! Make sure you subscribe to the channel and comment down below so we can stay in touch. Don't forget to like, share, and turn on your notification bell so you know when a new video comes out. Thank you. <laughs> we are doing something awesome today. We are partnering with Team C's to bring awareness to and make a change in our oceans. We're attempting to, through a two-prong effort, keep the oceans clean. So for us, for us that means, first of all, cleaning up the problem that exists. Second of all, preventing further problems. So we're out today, we're gonna be picking up some garbage near our local river. And the thing is that uh, the, whatever goes in the river, a lot of it ends up in the ocean. So if we can prevent garbage from getting in our rivers, it'll prevent it from flowing into the ocean. And so one of the things we're doing today is helping clean up. Thank you to Mr. Beast and Mark Rober and all the others who are pitching in together to make this a success. We want to join with them and make a difference. For our family, we believe that God put us here and gave us the responsibility of being good stewards of the earth he gave us. So that's what we're involved in. So you may be wondering, how can I get involved? Here's how. First of all, make some changes in prevention in your own life. Try to make sure that you are being more careful about how you handle your garbage. Secondly, go out and clean up. And the third and most important way is get involved with TeamSeas.org. We're gonna link them in the description. Go there, get involved. Here comes Ellie. <laughs> we put a big vest on her because she was cold. All right, should we talk to our dear friends? Can you look? Look at our dear friends. <laughs> yeah. And the trash doesn't slide down there. So the trash doesn't slide down there? No. That's right. Okay. So the way you guys can get involved at TeamSeas.org, every dollar that's donated takes a full pound of trash out of the ocean. So every $5, five pounds. And if you go check out this website, they break it down for you and show you just how amazing this process is of cleaning up the seas, cleaning up the oceans. They, they do it through the rivers, through the oceans, and through the beaches. So these things are cleaning up the oceans actively. Their goal is to raise $30 million before the end of the year. We are donating ourselves to TeamSeas.org and we'd love it if you guys would too. Thank you. Oh, Ellie has cold. my vest because it's cold. <laughs> my fingers are starting to get a little cold. You're cute, honey, I like it. Oh, it's okay. So yeah, we're gonna have the kids pick up some trash. Get out there, find that garbage, clean up the seas. Okay, the future lies in your hands. 
All right, let's head down here. Mommy and Ellie got the right idea. Oh, don't be scared. Go close to the river. Take the path close to the river. Bella's got the right idea. Bella, go by the river. Cleaning up garbage by the river. Yeah, this is a fun way to do something with the children that is mm -hmm. helping not just them, but the environment. It's active. You're outside in nature. Like, just it's a wonderful way to spend time. Hey, good job, guys. What'd you get? Wow. I, I got some fish food I and then some kind of beer whiskey thing. Okay, oh, some fishermen were leaving behind stuff. Yeah. Hey, yeah. okay, good job, guys. Good job. You gotta look deep to be able to try okay. this stuff. Hold on, hold on. We can do this. The thing is, all that stuff is right down by the river, so that stuff right. would have ended up downstream. Mm -hmm. Who knows the if it would have, right. it might have made it all the way to the all ocean. To the That's ocean. right. So, a very large portion of what goes into the rivers ends up in the oceans. That's why what we uh, are doing in partnering with Team Seas is so important. If you check, check out teamseas.org, if you donate there, every dollar you donate mm -hmm. will take a pound of garbage out of the ocean. Yeah. They've partnered with the, um, some of the biggest, uh, ocean Conservancy. the Ocean Conservancy and some other big organizations that are already at work doing this, but the funding that's being raised can literally take out dollar for pound. Every dollar equals a pound of garbage taken out of the ocean. So go check it out, teamseas.org. We're going to link it. So what we've decided as a family is since we've already over the years started implementing mm -hmm. things to make sure we're more careful about plastics and glass and, yeah. and things that need to be recyclables, mm -hmm. we've already started doing those things. We, that's the prevention. To us, it's a two-prong effort. It's cleanup and prevention. Right. And we've already done a lot of preventing and we're going to continue, but we're out here cleaning up as well. Yeah. Seriously, girl. Okay, hey guys. Yeah. Be careful. Uh, There's more trash. I got boots on. I think that's it. No, 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 no. <laughs> They're fighting over the trash. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Beast would be proud. <laughs> yeah. I think about cleaning up the seas. Good job. You got some garbage? Uh, yeah. <clears throat> People will be sitting by the river, tossing their trash while they sit down carelessly. It's a good place to look. <laughs> We're fine. We'll get it. <clears throat> Who 
Look at all that mess. Don't fall in. Look at all that. Daddy, this is good. You guys probably shouldn't be down there. Oh, you guys want to be, but look. Yeah. Oh, wow. I wish we could get that out of there, huh? I know, right? Can. See that? Yep. All right, hop up. All right, guys, so we found a bunch of garbage. Well, actually, the kids found a bunch. I was busy filming. So, what you got, Bella? I got, so, I know I found this cardboard. Oh, yeah, you got all kinds of Snack Coke something. bottle. Coke bottle, and then there's that down there. I don't know what Good what job. Is. Way to go. Alcohol, yeah. What'd you get, bud? Um, bunch of snacks, um, fish food, and a, just, like, plastic. Good food. job. Yeah. Good work out there, you guys. So do you think this would be one pound together? I think it's more than a pound. I think you've probably got a couple pounds. This is probably about a pound. I think you guys probably got about three pounds. Oh, Good job. $3. You did a great job, but we can do even more if we go donate at teamseas.org, yeah. right? Yeah. Ellie, what are they doing? They're dancing in the rain. Dancing in the rain? Can I see them? What has gotten into you guys? Where's the bag? We asked for some bags. We're about to go do our dog because it's raining and there's flooding everywhere. Flooding. This is what happens when you live in northern we Indiana. We are in the news and today we have the flood in America. It is everywhere getting to Florida and da da da. I, I wish we lived in Florida or something. It's too cold. I know. I'm African. I can't Why survive do you have this. rollerblades on? <laughs> so we can walk through salt water. <laughs> what do you think, Ellie? Get you want to get back on? <laughs> Does it look fun? Yeah, I'll get it's so cold out here. It's fun. <laughs> 